everyone and welcome to the Clearcut Classroom where we take deep dives into all things diamonds and jewelry. Today we're talking about how to start your engagement ring shopping experience. So you've been with your partner for a while and it's time to get engaged. You start talking about it but you don't really know where to start. Here are three things that you should do when getting your engagement ring process started. First and foremost, I would say before you do anything, try on as much as possible and do all your online research. I would encourage you to, whenever you're walking down the street, if you see a jewelry store, go try something on, take a photo. The more you know and the more you see, you'll be able to eliminate things you definitely don't like and try to slowly figure out the things that you do like. And once you've honed in on the carat weight of the diamond you're looking for, the shape and overall style, that is a good place for us to start. The second thing you wanna do is also make sure you and your partner are on the same page in terms of what you wanna spend and your budget for the ring. Some couples value the engagement ring a lot more than others, and the three month salary, it's a good baseline, but it's really a myth that is a bit antiquated. No one really goes off of that anymore. Some people spend way more than three months salary and some people spend way less, but it's good to get aligned on a top line budget where you're like, this is our cutoff and everything below that, we can find you a gorgeous ring. The third thing you wanna do is once you have that information on what you're looking for in terms of the look of your stone and your ring, the budget you wanna stay within, Find a trusted expert you want to work with. Make sure you know who you're working with. Do they work with natural diamonds? Do they work with lab grown, depending on what you want? Are they working with GIA certified diamonds? Because all other labs are not going to have as strict of standards as GIA. And are they graduate gemologists? Are they certified? Are they experts? And you want to make sure that you find someone that you trust that you work with. Those are the three things you wanna do before getting your engagement process started. Let me know if you have any other questions and class is dismissed.